Junior Bridgman played the majority of his career for the Milwaukee Bucks, averaging just 13 points per game. Originally drafted 8th overall by the Los Angeles Lakers, Bridgman was quickly the cornerstone of a deal for Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. While he did come off the bench, it was almost always as the 6th man, and had the 6th man of the year award been around prior to the 1983 season, he likely would have won several times. Though that may be the case, in the 1970s being one of the best six men in the league didn't pay the big bucks, with his most lucrative contract being a mere $350,000. However, Bridgman would spend his off-season studying the ins and outs of his favorite restaurant, Wendy's. While Junior was impressive on the court, his business acumen is Hall of Fame worthy. By working at Wendy's in the off-season, he learned the business model of a fast food restaurant. After retirement, Junior invested heavily in the restaurant chain, at one point owning over 100 Wendy's and Chili's. In 2018, Bridgman opted to sell all of his franchises to become an official bottler for Coca-Cola. In 2020, Junior expanded his portfolio again when he bought Ebony and Jet magazine for $14 million. While Junior will likely never make it into the NBA Hall of Fame for his play, the Milwaukee Bucks retired his number two. Now, Bridgman's net worth sits at $600 million, second only to Michael Jordan.